Hello, dear travelers. Today we will take you on a tour of the beautiful city of Guadalajara, Mexico. In this video, we will show you all of the best things to do while you're in Guadalajara, like going for a walk in Zona Centro, go to museums, get lost in the largest market in the Americas, Hidalgo Market, and Colonia Americana. But before we get started, if you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe so you don't miss any of our future adventures. All right, guys, we made it to beautiful Guadalajara. We are in front of the Catedral of Jalisco and it is enormous. It is huge and it is just beautiful. It is in the center of the city. This is where everything is happening in the city. It's surrounded by many plazas and many other buildings. We're gonna show you around all the different places around the city. So let's go. I do see some really nice area where you can sit here. You can also find a lot of horses right here in the city. Plaza de Armas located right next to the main church. You have different options to how to get around the city. You have options for tours on a rickshaw with the horse, and it will take you around the center of the city, take you on a tour of the beautiful areas of the city. It's 400 pesos for around 30 to 45 minutes. Now we are in front of the beautiful Rotonda. This is a monument to commemorate all the heroes of the beautiful state of Jalisco. And there's plenty of statues here to commemorate them. You can also see a lot of security here, a lot of police that secure in the area. It feels very safe. You can also take this bus that's gonna take you around the city and it's cost 200 pesos for the whole day pass. You have here Teatro de Goyado. This beautiful building was built on the 19th century. It is big, it is gorgeous. You can find here many performances, dances, opera. Let's get a closer look. Look at this beautiful building. Now standing in this location is where the first homes were built in Guadalajara. So I guess the homes are not there anymore. Now it's the Justice Building and next one is the University of Guadalajara. This is a Plaza Tapatia, and in this plaza, this is exactly where you can find all this artisan market, with a beautiful handmade craft. If 
you are looking for a good price on a gold and silver jewelry, then Zona Central has your back. You can find buildings full of stores that sells all type of jewelry. We couldn't record inside, but we found some good deals for ourselves. You can find here a really cool benches, very similar to Puerto Vallarta and the Malikon. So we are at Museo Cabañas. Now this beautiful building used to be a large orphanage and now it's been turned to a museum with beautiful art. It's said that on Tuesdays it's free to get in. We're about to go find out. Let's go. This is huge. When you're standing here, you for, you can forget that you are in the second biggest city in all of Mexico. I mean, feels like you're in the middle of nowhere. It's so quiet. Very quiet. That's my We are going to the Plaza La Mariaches and definitely on this side of the town it's much busier. So it's more musician area here. You, they, you can buy guitars here. So you can see that they plan inside the restaurant for people that dine and eat. It is mariachi. We decided to try this place. They have two for one sandwiches that it's kind of a traditional here for Guadalajara. Let's see how it is. What are we eating today? We're eating torta ahogadas, which is a sandwich with carnita, then that's pork, and it's soaked in uh, tomato juice. So it's called wet sandwich. Wet sandwich. It's a traditional food here in the state of Jalisco. So if you're in the state of Jalisco, you gotta try it. Let's try it. Very crunchy. You feel the juiciness of the pork? Mm -hmm. Here we are on Sunday in Guadalajara Plazas. Look how busy it is compared to the regular days in the week. Everybody's off, so everybody coming with the family to walk around, enjoy this beautiful sunny day. I love it. So we are here at the largest market in all land in America. They have everything here, so let's go explore a little bit so you can show you how it looks. On the first floor, you have a lot of food. So in this section here, they have all the 
local sandwich, which is like big sandwich that has, I guess, pork. And it looks delicious. We might just stop there later, but it, it's a whole section dedicated to this type of sandwich. When walking around, it's like sections of everything. They have a section for birds, chicken, sandwich. It's all one large organized mess. <laughs> You need like the whole day to spend here and just to discover all type of shops that they have. It's like huge. Come. Anybody need Louis Vuitton? Maybe Gucci? It's all divided in sections. It looks like we just got to the section where the food section is. But this is just one part of the food section. There's also a place where it's just Japanese food, Asian food. Let's just walk around so we can show you how it looks. There's a, a lot of everything. Today it's Sunday, so it's probably the busiest day on the week when everybody's out eating. So you can see here are three huge floors and it's basically endless. Like I said, you need the whole day here to spend so you can just discover some of the shops. So it looks like the third floor is mostly clothing. So we're gonna go check out the clothing to see some real replicas. Not fake, real replicas. <laughs> Look, if you save on your Air Jordans collection, they have some here. <laughs> Some uh, swimming shirts for you from Dior. <laughs> the Adidas, <laughs> Nike, Boss. You have your scarves, like wallets, anything like this place is amazing. And when you live in the big market, you still have a lot of artisan shops here around. Here you can find more of traditional Mexican clothing. Today we're gonna show you a different area of Guadalajara and it's called Colonia Americana and it's just down a few blocks away from the central part of Guadalajara so we're gonna show you this wonderful town definitely has a downtown feeling. They definitely have a lot of uh, nice restaurants and bars in this area, like really beautiful. Let's try some burger. Delicious. 
dollars for two burgers, three burritos, and for two drinks, it was 240 pesos. It's a really good deal, and the food is amazing. This place is really, really nice. It's uh, the feeling here is completely modern feeling. And the restaurants here are pretty good. You can see a lot of choices. You have your uh, sushi, Mexican, you have Starbucks, you have everything here. There's a lot of universities around here. So this is uh, a lot for the younger people. I'm guessing this at night is like a night town. Yeah, probably they have bars and music and nightclubs here kind of thing. And that will be all for today. Thank you so much for your support. If you enjoy the content, please hit the like button and subscribe. And see you again next week.